Hello friends, how many of you think that business is really tough? And being into business, you cannot manage and balance your spiritual life. Hello my dear friends, Namaste and welcome in our yet another new beautiful episode which is really very inspiring and interesting. Today we have a great businessman who started his meditation journey in 1997 and not only that, he served PSSM as a trustee and Secretary of PSSM Kartal. So we have a wonderful personality, a dynamic personality, Sudesh Shahji, who is a founder of Creamstone Business. And he really worked hard to be into spiritual path as well, balancing his professional life. It was the beginning of his life journey, but after starting meditation, let's know how he simplified his life, how his business was in autopilot mode and still he worked for mankind. So let's welcome Sudesh Shahji. So welcome. Namaskar, yeah, sir. Yeah. How are you doing, sir? Fine, sir. Thank you. Thank, thank you for giving you. the opportunity to take the interview. I must say thank you for managing your time. Being a great businessman in a Hyderabad, you could manage your time and uh, you could provide us this time. I have a lot of regards with the, our PMC. So this is my opportunity. <laughs> I must utilize. Thank, thank you. you. Thank, thank you. you. It will definitely help a lot of people, you know, because this journey is not, not that easy. Yeah. Uh, I can say that normal people who use, who lead their normal life, the day-to-day -day mundane life, uh, that is different life. But you, being a businessman, yeah. how did you start your meditation journey? First, before knowing that, please share uh, about you. I'm Sudhisha. I'm the managing partner of Hotel Haridwa. It's located in Koti, Isamabajar, Hyderabad. At the same time, I am Managing Director of Sri Srinivasa Dairy Products Private Limited. A brand name is Scoops and Creamstone. The same thing, it is located in Koti, Hyderabad. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, sir, how did you start your meditation journey? Yeah, it is a, one, of, one of the best, uh, fantastic. One of the, my, uh, my income tax officer, uh, I used to meet him pretty frequently. Means my intuition started in 97. Mm -hmm. So, I used to meet him and he used to guide me. I used to take this opinion. Sir, I, I want to do the meditation. Please guide me. Then he told I know Subhash Patriji. Uh, I'll take the appointment. He used to come and he used to do the meditation. Mm -hmm. I don't remember the exact name right now. The 97 is too long. But he showed the way, path to, towards go to just kindly meet Subhash Patriji. And then he will try to, he does good fruit and have place fruit like that he's told. Okay, sir, whatever maybe you, you're telling, then, then definitely take. In 97, uh, uh, December, the, he took the appointment within Alwal Modli's house. Mm -hmm. That was in the, from, from my quote, it takes about 10, 20 kilometers okay. towards Mechel area. Okay. So it was quite winter. So the, the, he gave the appointment by to come by 7 o'clock, morning 7 o'clock. So uh, morning 5 o'clock, I waked up, I took bath, that too in winter, thick winter. <laughs> then I took the, my car and went towards the uh, Mechel area, Alwal. I, one day before, I saw, just saw the house. It was first quite easy to locate the house. I went there and I sat uh, by 6 o'clock. I was there. From 6 o'clock, I was just observing the sir is watching the TV and reading the newspaper. And uh, he didn't call me. I was just sitting just, uh, outside the hall, I mean, something like that. And up to 7.30, then quarter to 8. Then I called Alva Murli. Uh, sir, uh, I have to go join my business. Just if sir says something, then I'll just say hello and go. Okay, brother, just wait for five minutes. Then I'll go and ask permission. Then he went inside. Sir, one of the meditator wants to meet with you. Okay, come, what he just said. Then he called me. Ha, who are you? I'm Sudesha. What do you do? Uh, what will Harith Okay. Okay, why you are coming? I want to learn the meditation. Okay, go to Anand Man's house every Friday. 5 o'clock is the day, they'll teach meditation. Go and learn and come. Mm -hmm. That's all. That's all. Please go. Okay, he just, he told. Immediately, I just came back. 
So what was the quest behind? Because you being into business, yeah. uh, what was that quest that you wanted to do any meditation? Who suggested you before? Ha, that uh, my uh, the toy, I mean, income tax officer. He only he suggested. Only suggested. Okay. I know the guru, Subhash Ji. Right. He will guide you. Uh, he right. plays good for the flute. Uh, actually, the intuition started. I was feeling distress okay. my business. Okay. And negativeness, people will come, something. Uh, once positive, whatever may be the in, in terms of meditation, right. spirituality. Right. So I was getting distress. I'm not happy with my, my with my work. Okay. Though that time I was running hotel, I was running my steam factory. Yeah. But uh, I was not happy right. with the family and some atmospheric, lot of stress, business, business stress. So I want to come towards the spirituality path. Right. That uh, that intuition started in bed in uh, approximately around September October of ninety seven. So, so what happened when you started meditation? I for, huh, I'm just sharing my experience. Eh? Yes. Then then first meeting was there with the uh, it was in Banjarals that Anmol's house that sometimes he used to between every Friday between five to seven. Mm -hmm. That was slot every Friday once a week once a week. So we used to go there assemble there. Sometimes in Anandwa's house, we used to conduct upstairs meditation or sometimes in, in the parking area. Right. We have to clear ourselves parking area and we have to sit there and do meditation. So, uh, today, if you just see, no one will uh, come, like, business people coming, uh, sweeping the uh, well, uh, parking area and uh, doing this type of activity. Okay, anyway, the intuition started burning. I must learn the meditation. That was my ambition. Right. So that it continued. Hmm. So how was, as you said that there is some distress or uh, you were not that happy in business. Yes. Uh, how it changed after meditating, after starting meditation? Ah, it's uh, after due course. It, uh -huh. it takes time. No? It takes, the right. Meditation, it takes time. True. Uh, <clears throat> after medita doing meditation, a lot of changes happened in my life. So a lot of negativity has gone. Mm -hmm. like I, I, stress, stress was totally dissolved. I was doing business with very peacefully, right. enjoying the my happiness of doing the business. That was the art. This is the meditation technique. If you do simultaneous meditation and if you do the business ourselves, the you will enjoy the our nature of work. Right, right. So you are the person I can say one of the pillar, one of the. Uh, you know, starting friend of Patriji when he started uh, this PSSM. Yes. Right. So, how was your journey with him? How it was earlier? Uh, so, I, as I told earlier, I I just met sir in ninety seven December. Right. Then, my my I was not happy with doing only with meditation. Right. So, uh, I was meet sir at any time. <clears throat> that the burning issue was in my in my intuition. Right. So I used to take the appointment. Means the appointment means like uh, I used to trace where service stays like that. So he used to stay in the Amberpet area mm -hmm. that time. Mm -hmm. yeah, from my Koti area to Amberpet is hardly three, four, 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 four kilometers. So ten to fifteen meters is the journey. So I used to meet them. Uh, I used to trace them, sir. How I should go and be there. Uh, means take, uh, take where sir stays. Everything like that. First meeting was that in the Amberpet house. Mm -hmm. I met in the afternoon time, then afternoon around 12, 12, 12 mm -hmm. to 1 we had some gaps up, mm -hmm. like same thing, mm -hmm. some 5, 6 people had people were there in the room, in the hall, right. in that old house right. of Padriji. Then he told, please go to have, have lunch. Mm -hmm. Then when I went inside uh, for lunch, nothing was there. Okay. <laughs> then Sonavala means ma'am and uh, mommy, nothing is there, how can? <laughs> Oh. Then, uh, okay, they understood the situation. Okay. Then immediately, I used to run the hotel na, rest time, restaurant. Yeah. Then I telephoned my person right. from there, from nearby booth, public booth. At the time, no pager, nothing, no phone, right. cell phones. Yes. Then he be, be in a tiffin box, he carried some rice, sambar, tiffin, everything, curry. Then he brought and just see. Then from backside area, I just kept it inside. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then first, the first experience was to have the lunch with the sir. Then whenever, uh, whenever I used to go, I used to carry my lunch for not only for the sir and family, about 10-15 people because I knew some 5-6 uh, people may join for the lunch or dinner, whatever maybe, some mm -hmm. snacks, some, something. So I used to carry my car and 
keep it in the <laughs> kitchen <laughs> like that. Mm. The store used to begin like that. Okay. So I used to meet sir frequently. Very nice, very nice of you. And uh, what was the thing that you wanted to meet him? <laughs> what were you actually enjoying with him? Uh, the means uh, something. I must meet guru. I must become close, and uh, that uh, happiness I used to get. The energy I used to get from the sir. Yes. That energy I used to get. Because it's not easy that every time uh, I should go and he used to give the energy. <clears throat> Whenever I used to give, meet him, na, I used to feel very happy, very relaxed. I used to get energy, lot of energy. That's the my uh, then frequency of the visit started. Did you teach meditation to people? Ha! Huh? At that time. <laughs> okay. Yes. Uh, can I just share the story with yes, the sir like that? Yes. Yes. Yeah, please. Yeah. So when I met sir, na, he used to tell us to. Uh, conduct uh, some meet, uh, meetings in Hyderabad mm -hmm. uh, between ten to five. Sometimes I booked a Marathi Grand Sangralaya in Koti area mm -hmm. next to my hotel, mm -hmm. and uh, we gave the ID in there, in that also. And the uh, people means uh, all women from uh, they started gathering some ten fifteen peoples, and maybe I don't remember exactly. And then the hall was lit, and even uh, we distributed some plumpets in the uh, Koti area, so thickly populated bus stand. So we distributed some plumpets also. That was my beginning of uh, my uh, distribution of plumpets. Some walkers came, they sat for some time, but they could not understand. But those were 10 to 15 people, we, ha we had meditation from 10 to 5. Then they, even that time also, we used to provide some lunch for the meditators. Then uh, Sir told me one day, can we go to Nijamabad and Nid Nirmal and Adilabad? So <clears throat> we, you have the scopes distribution network. Can you arrange some meeting in that area? Sir, definitely, sir. Why not? Then immediately I spoke with my my distributors mm -hmm. in Nijamabad, Nirmal, and Adilabad, and uh, I told him also give a instruction to give a small ad, mm -hmm. whatever may be that time may be in Inaro. There was Inaro was one of the best the circulated and plumpets also. So I took the car. We drove towards the hmm, Nijamabad. And uh, Nizamabad, we had this evening five o'clock meeting was there, mm -hmm. and uh, my my distributors booked the one big function hall. As <laughs> <laughs> it thinking over five hundred people may gather. Okay. And uh, when we saw there, we, we did a lot of exercise to pull the crowd. Yes. But that was the beginning of SARS yeah, ninety eight. Yeah. Uh, hardly five people came. Oh my God. <laughs> hardly. So I was seeing sir. Sir was seeing me. No, no. Don't get distressed, Sudhir. This is my first beginning. We'll conduct the classes for the five people. And because stage was there and everything, means why it's, it's, yeah, we booked yeah. the function all uh, like that. Okay, sir. No, sir. No problem. We conducted a class for one hour. We had meditation there. Then we had second meeting in Nirmal. By mm -hmm. 8 o'clock, we had second meeting. Mm -hmm. From Nizamabad, hardly 30, 40 kilometers. Mm -hmm. Nirmal. So then we again, we took the car. We went to the Nirmal. 8 o'clock again, the class was in the uh, Lawrence Club had up uh, Nirmal. They mm -hmm. conducted the class. Its president and secretary, I know them. I telephoned them. He, he took the again same story. Hardly four people. So again he but he he again he told him don't get distressed. We conducted the class. Then we had dinner there. Mm -hmm. Then we stayed in that Nirmal hotel also. Okay. Uh, again, sir uh, sir told me I want to see the movie. Oh, I'm being a spirit movie <laughs> that. <too. laughs> To see the Telugu movie, अरे बाप रे बाप, okay sir we'll go बोल के बोले, तो we'll it's opposite to my hotel where we used to stay. Uh huh. Nine thirty was the show, we took the tickets, we 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 then twelve thirty we came by walking. Okay. And we slept we slept in same room. That was my first. Did you enjoy it with him? Ha! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Arey, it was great opportunity, na? From taking taking to drive and just uh, journey me, yeah. baat karte hain jana. Has, yeah. uh, means everything was really funny. It was funny. What are your main learnings from Patriji? Being so close to him, mm -hmm. what are your learnings? But he used to tell, do meditation. That's all. Do meditation and do become perfect. Right. Then Swasami Sadhyasam, the subject was there. He used to tell every time, hey, is the, but no one, whoever comes too close, he used to tell the same thing. Swasam is the only key. How you practice, you will become the perfect. That was the key. Uh, the message is they used to give. 
whenever I just uh, personally anything is there, I used to tell them, used to guide me, uh, don't get uh, overreacted. Let the people may say something about you, negativity. Let him say, but don't react. That was the message from the sir. That was help me. That helped me. Let him. Uh, if 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 I'm not if I'm wrong, my conscience will tell. Yeah. Uh, if we, uh, who are you to tell my conscience is wrong or right? Like that, the message he used to tell me. He used to guide me. Who oh, sir? Sir used to guide me. Like that. So again, I'm just continuing my journey. So from Nirmal again, we we saw we had breakfast in morning uh, around eight o'clock. Then we went towards uh, Adilabad. Mm-hmm. Adilabad also about twelve thirty one o'clock we had lunch something. Then class was uh, around four o'clock. That time we we roam about nearby some two spots and we just went there mm-hmm. four o'clock. Again four o'clock again the same story. Uh, this hardy four five people came then. Uh, we again he sir used to conduct a class that was a peculiarity either either maybe three or four or maybe the number is less but he will conduct the class okay then we conducted a class then we greeted them and uh, we came to Hyderabad mm-hmm. Hyderabad and uh, we like that uh, story journey started so he used to tell uh, like that I used to meet very very frequently with the sir in each in festivals like uh, Diwali. Sometimes the sera holy. <laughs> just whenever I get uh, time, I used to just go and meet meet them. So you just wanted to meet him. Yes, yes. How do you manage your time? You are you are into business and you yes. have to do lot of things in yes, your business. Yes, thank you. So how did you manage your time? Ha, between Monday to I'm I'm uh, my my business was autopilot. Okay. Ha. Okay. So I'm not cust- customized to sit in cashier or I must to p- do my business. Ah, I can attend. I should go. My I used to do my business bit when supervisor and taking reports yeah. and all. Teams was there, like managers, <clears throat> accountants, everything. But I have to manage them. Nine nine o'clock means nine means I will be in sharp in my office. <clears throat> that was my discipline. And evening whenever the time is in between some business people will get time. Right. Uh, evening sometimes slot is there four o'clock or five o'clock one one hour. <clears throat> so whenever I used to get time. I used to be. Mm. So you were a free bird that yeah, time yeah. also. <laughs> <laughs> How was your support from family? I had two children at that time. Okay. Uh, two daughters. Okay. Uh, I got married in eighty four. Okay. During ninety seven, ninety eight, <clears throat> I had two children. They were in schools. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Saturday, Sunday, I used to enjoy with the children. Okay. Because the evening they used to go evening nine o'clock. Evening we come by evening three o'clock, mm-hmm. and they have their own homework. So only thing. Saturday and Sunday, I used to get take him to the outing, right? Uh, like parks, movies. That time, whatever the hotels available. So I think you are fortunate enough to be with Padriji very closely. What are the other things are there for which you are happy more? When I become so close, so sir, I gave the opportunity. Why not? I should become a trustee of the Kartal Pyramid, uh-huh. Kailash Puri. <clears throat> so yes, definitely, I took the responsibility. He made me. Trustee, we had a lot of uh, trustees in seven eight trustees. Mm-hmm. We used to conduct uh, every uh, every again some Saturday something between five to seven o'clock. Vijay Bhaskar, Vijay Sri Ram Gopal, all these trustees were there. We used to conduct meetings, and we used to try to develop the how best we should develop the pyramid. Mm-hmm. And sometimes sir used to join. We used to give the valuable sessions, like that. Sir, he made me secretary also, uh, <laughs> but I then I handled for the one or two years. Then I told sir, sir, I can't handle the secretary because of the my my responsibilities are getting increased. My business, so okay. I voluntarily just resigned it. Then I gave sir, sir, I can't manage it. I apologize, my dear. No, no, don't get apologize. But whatever you you have done the best for the two years, it's appreciable. The I give give responsibility to someone like that. So I became then. But meanwhile, I have never lost the. We used to meet the all trustees and we do the lot of uh, activities for the prospectors for the. Kartal Trust. Mm-hmm. So, could you please share that journey? Uh, how did you serve this organization that time? Oh, lovely! Ah, it's too difficult, na? The time, the to purchase the land, to acquire the land, and uh, that to uh, from away city, sir. Some handful people went to that land. <coughs> sir has selected particular that place. There was no proper road. 
no other thing. Even today, the roads are perfectly laid and everything. Today we can go. But to to visit that venue, it's something like it. Uh, <laughs> uh, it is in something in Pahar. Yeah. It's something in mountain. Some small uh, place has been eroded. To reach that mountain, it is something like it. So it's too difficult to reach that place. But anyhow, but uh, that uh, that power of meditation, that sad intuitions. <clears throat> Definitely, that one of the best uh, Miss Pyramid will come in the head of it. That was aim, and it it uh, it do, it got clicked. <laughs> it got clicked. Yeah. Today it's not easy to acquire such a big land and everything to face from the without any funds. That to something led, something led right? without any funds we acquired the lands. That was a peculiarity. <laughs> that is a great manifestation of that yes. time because great manifestation, sir. It's all because of the Padriji sir. It would not have been happened. It would not have been uh, designed. Means whatever may be there. It was not just a matter of money, but some other other energy. Now, ha, now still exactly. people say that uh, that is the first biggest pyramid in our India. And uh, after Bangalore, na? No? After Bangalore. yes. Yeah. But this is the biggest. Yeah. Bangalore. Yeah. One eighty by one eighty. Yes. I remember. Yeah. And its energy is uh, spread, I think, around. Yes, it's a great journey. It's a great journey. I just sir is to read so many books. You might have. Learned. Yes, I heard that. So, uh, yeah, uh, share that thing about. Yeah. Uh, oh, sir, speculating. I will just share. Huh? Yes, please. He used to carry all spiritual books right. whenever, either in Telugu, English, or Hindi, <clears throat> in bag. Wherever we go, somewhere, something. So, please remove the bag. So they just given them on that particular book or particular pamphlet, whatever may be, mm -hmm. to a th third person. Mm -hmm. So that that was the message. Uh, but he used to read so many books, so many books. Uh, it's a in uh, even. Uh, <laughs> it's not easy. Ah, uh, not easy. Not easy. Not easy. Not easy. Bah. Wherever, whenever he feels time, he will not waste the time. He will read the books, and he will pick up, he will underline, underline what is the important message. And then, uh, whenever we some handful handful of people we meet, he used to tell about the message from books, and he used to tell us to read particular this book, particular that book. <laughs> yeah. Well, I would, I don't know someone how he get the books also. <laughs> it was something, <laughs> I mean, in, unimaginable. It's a even to procure so many books to read so many books. It's a it's a great uh, energy. It's a great yeah. energy. One should have a great consistency for that because uh, reading and learning, yes. it's his passion, but it's really not easy for normal people in our day to day life. Yes, yes. it's a true, it's true, absolutely. Passion is important and the learning and reading what you said exactly and to send the message, to pass the message, that is foremost. No? Yeah. So, so, number of people we might be reading the books, but he will not pass the message to the others. Right. But such speculate he used to give the message to everyone ki do meditation, your life will improve. Means whatever may be the Yeah, uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. In positive way. In a positive way. Yes. Well, uh, do you read books? Ah, I <laughs> I'm a poor reader. Okay. But apart from that, whenever he, he gives some books, one or two books, I used to keep uh, read whenever I feel time. I just read a paragraph and he, he tests my exam also. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, okay. Could you please share that? Ah, yeah, yeah. When he gives some books, nah, read particular para and come me and explain me tomorrow. What okay, used to tell me? Punishment, I used to read this. <laughs> <laughs> so he was a strict teacher. Ah, I used to, yeah, yes, yes. <laughs> so, particularly paragraph, I used to read. I, used to, I must try to understand what exactly the meaning is that. Mm. And then, then I used to. I tell them. Then he used to correct me also. No, no, this is the, the meaning says like this. Okay, okay. <laughs> like absolutely, the master is master. See, okay. juniors are junior, but uh, my observation and his perceptions has to get the frequencies to get match. Right. Yes. Wonderful, uh, Sudhirji, to learn to know about your journey with Patriji. It's really very interesting. And uh, so, sir, how did you implement spirituality in business? Uh, how was your main takeaway from Patriji and how did you really implement it in your uh, professional life? Business will grow, but simultaneously doing meditation, 
the my business will be four folds increased okay ha ah, this is a peculiarity no today people may understand may not understand but i feel myself we do the meditation bath spiritual bath <clears throat> your business will grow your corrections of the business will come as and when required mm -hmm. because that energy level will definitely take the uh, vibrant right yeah vibrations will come right. uh, negativity of the um, in business will go and positiveness of the business will come how to increase how to um, way to gap is there in business way to um, the gap has to fulfill fulfill that all ideas intuitions will come in meditation only because once the mind is calm and uh, the when mind is calm you are getting good number of ideas yes either in business or in spiritual path or whichever path this is uh, all everyone knows today says message be calm be do meditation and this the message something swasam is there some so all this this is the only key you must keep our mind calm if people says don't listen don't uh, react and don't <laughs> try to see the abend them so whatever the negativity is comes it goes it goes away and the positiveness and ideas will create i must say you are a true karma yogi yeah. being into business you did uh, spiritual services as well so that is a great thing <laughs> absolutely yes. it's a uh, it's a bank balance we can say Yeah. of my karma whatever we have been chosen with this path yeah uh, with business see any family need some uh, business people right uh, to to come uh, to manage to become to manage the business it need lot of energy either in managing partner or managing trust managing director of the company it needs lot of energy so that energy it requires means it comes through meditation this is my my experience yes well so I mean, you have managed very well that financial part. Yes. And it's not easy because a lot of people stepping into business is very easy, but sustaining that business is not that easy. So you being into business, how did you fulfill your purpose of life? The manage to manage the financial part, it's a great, uh, it's great challenge. What you said exactly, he to manage means it takes. But automatically, the, what I said, do meditation. Na, the uh, that uh, we'll get the answers. We'll get the uh, methods, ideas. It will ideas, show the path, path. Path. Right. That is a success story. My message is that everyone should do meditation, do the business, and do expand your uh, meditation path. Right. So thank you, Sudhir sir, for coming and uh, the wonderful job you did for mankind. being into business you served pssm world and so many people at the end uh, your message to our audience uh, lovely to join this um, this pssm movement i met lot of old masters senior masters and new masters everything karta means new masters <coughs> we learn lot of things and uh, <coughs> my message is that do meditation spread meditation and uh, enjoy your life wonderful thank you thank, thank you. you so friends i must say you watch this episode and please like share subscribe pms english and share this video with everyone thank you so much